on this episode of the Ultimate Dry Aging Project, we're going to use the Tyson Chairman's Reserve Pork Belly and Boneless Pork Loin to create the Ultimate Porchetta. You don't normally think of dry aging porchetta, but dry aging it for seven days creates an incredibly crisp exterior texture while also relaxing all the protein strands so it doesn't burst open while you're roasting it. First, we're going to strip all of the silver skin and extraneous fat from the outside of the loin before we submerge it in a incredibly flavorful brine. After our pork loin's been sitting overnight, we're gonna take it out, pat it dry. We're going to cross hatch cut both sides of our pork belly. And we spread a seasoning paste made of pork fat, Dijon mustard, rosemary, and roasted garlic. Next, we're gonna roll the pork loin in the pork belly trussing it with butcher's twine. Now it's gonna go into the dry ager for the next seven days. After seven days, we're gonna roast our whole porchetta in the oven at 300 degrees for two hours, finishing it at 400 degrees for another hour. As you're cutting through the layers, you're gonna have the delicious crackle of the outer skin, the juicy interior of the pork belly, followed up by the lovely texture of the brined pork loin. From a food service perspective, this application has a lot of uses. You can create sandwiches, center of the plate proteins, or even a high-end carving station. I really think that the dry aging process adds a whole new level of umami and texture to this already classic dish.